off we go to Granham, Alberta, a small town where big things are happening at Investment Vehicle Restorations. That's where we've been following the restoration of a 71 GTX. It's owned by Josh LeVar, who is restoring it with his father, Terry. We've been following this restoration from the very beginning. They're going to paint the car today, and then ultimately, they're going to sell it. Well, here we are, one month into the restoration, and the entire car is in primer. Now comes the next exciting part, where the car goes up on the rotisserie. And this is exciting because we know that the car won't come down until it's fully painted. When you're painting a show car, first order business is you need to get paint on the entire car. That's inside, out, and underneath. Okay, first thing we do is we mask off the parts and we paint the undersides of the hood, fenders, doors, and trunk lid. The car then gets moved into the paint booth, put up on the rotisserie, and we paint the entire underneath and inside the trunk compartment. While the car is still on the rotisserie, we take advantage of the mobility in order to paint the outside of the panels. Once the outside of the body panels are painted, we take the car down and move it out of the booth, and we bring all the parts in, and then we paint the outside of all of them. But we're not done yet. Once we've done all that, we're gonna wet sand and polish the clear coat we just put on so that the car is forever trapped in that perfect, wet, fresh, just out of the booth look. We're gonna block the entire car with 600 grit wet. Then we're gonna move to 800 grit. We're gonna keep going up the grit scale here. 1,000, 1,200, 1,500, and finally we're gonna finish with 2,000. So now that the whole car has been painted, we can start the long, tedious process of putting it all back together. We will continue to follow the restoration of that awesome 71 GTX in future episodes of SST, so stay